they brutalized two men in the police station. Their violent assault on Jairaj and Benix allegedly led to their deaths. And now it's clear that the Tutukudi police have lied, and that too in a first information report. CCTV visuals from Satan Kulam on the night of June 19th clearly show that the police's version of events is totally false. See this frame. The time on the CCTV camera is 21.42. According to the shopkeeper, the CCTV camera is 1 hour and 40 minutes fast, which means the actual time is 8.2 pm, just two minutes past the curfew time. This man in white is Jairaj, who is casually standing outside the shop that he owns. For several minutes prior to the scene, Jairaj has been standing outside. He is wearing a mask, hardly making any conversation. Two policemen walk up to Jairaj, they talk to him for two minutes and then they walk away. Jairaj goes back to standing for a few seconds. He then walks across the road to the police vehicle that has been standing there throughout. According to eyewitnesses, this is when the police called him over. About a minute and a half later, auto driver Pandi, who has been watching the police talk to Jairaj, walks into the shop and soon a group of people from inside the shop come out to see what's happening. Then Benix walks out of the shop and crosses the road. His friend Rajaram is right behind him. The two of them can be seen standing next to the police vehicle. Almost a minute later, Benix and Rajaram return to the shop. The police vehicle drives away with Jairaj. Then Benix and others are talking on the phone, probably informing family members about the development. Within minutes, Benix gets on the bike behind his friend and rides to the police station. This entire scene is in direct contradiction to what the police have said in the FIR. According to the police, the incident happened at 9.15 on June 19. They claim there was a crowd outside Jairaj and Benix's shop, which as you can see is not the case. The police in their FIR claim there was an altercation between them and the father-son duo. But there is no visible tension between Jairaj and the policemen. The police also claim that Jairaj and Benik sat on the floor outside their shops, abused the cops and rolled around on the ground, which caused internal injuries. None of these claims are true as per the CCTV visuals. The police also claim that they took Jairaj and Benix into custody together. Witnesses have clearly said that Benix went to the station after the police took away Jairaj. And this is the version corroborated by these visuals, clearly busting the police version.